Back at it. September the 30th, 2020. We now have the uh, final piece of the puzzle, the Miami Heat, the fire uh, to go with the water. First comes the fire, then comes the water. But in this case, the water came first and then came the fire. So we, we see the matchup with the Lakers and the Heat set for the uh, NBA Finals of 2020. We know they have an end date that they uh, set at the beginning of the actual uh, playoff bubble, which is October the 13th. Okay, and October the 13th would mean that this would be a seven game series. And being that we've been following this pattern with this 41 code with the Lakers, uh, we know that a seven game series is four to three to the winner, and 43 is a 14 prime number. So we see the 41 14 mirror uh, still valid with the Lakers. We see Jimmy Butler here being. Uh, promoted by the NBA in game one saying, you know, get your popcorn ready, the heat gonna come out blazing hot, you know first the fire has to get started, get cooking, get burning, it torched the east, they torched the east they took out everyone in the east as I had indicated the fire would take out the entire east and meet the west uh, versus the Lakers the Lakers drowned the west they flooded the west and uh this is a matchup. We have LeBron James and Anthony Davis, the two best ballers in the association on the same team. <clears throat> on the same team and a team that is known to win, a winning organization. Their number is 233. We know 233 is the 13th Fibonacci number. It's the 51st prime number. We know we have the uh, number one seed Lakers against the number five seed Heat. We see the Heat. We see some, some kind of way the Heat ended up getting uh, Jay Crowder, Andre Iguodala, and Solomon Hill from Memphis. You know, it's like I first seen Tyre Hero on the summer league balling out, and he could have won that, but they didn't. The, the Grizzlies did, and then midseason, they made a trade with the Grizzlies. I don't know how they got all three of those guys. I don't know who they gave up. I don't know the details of the trade, but I know that, you know, they're on there in the uh, Grizzlies would have had a deep run in the playoff if they had had those guys. And then we know that uh, this is going to be a big deal, a big series. It's going to be a entertaining series, highly competitive. It's a lot of highly skilled athletes that are going to be participating in this. The Heat have a lot of highly skilled guys on their team, guys that could really uh, – Put up buckets. We see eyes on the prize. Hollywood versus South Beach. Uh, the water versus the fire. We see LeBron is eyeing another championship. We see the uh, thing I was interested in was the uh, the officials for the game, and we're going to talk about those shortly. But we also see the Heat. We see this. Uh, optic here and we're looking to see what kind of codes are being displayed here we see that 147 with hero and Dragic. we know the lakers coach will have 47 wins if they win the, the uh, finals we see the 239 with lebron and rondo rondo is going to be big in this we know 239 is the 34th prime number we know the lakers coach is sitting on 33 losses right now frank vogel so we see uh an alignment right there that's indicating uh, a game one win for the Heat. We see the NBA announces 12 officials for the 2020 finals. 12 officials like the 12 signs of the Zodiac. We know that basketball has to do with the sun. It has to do with throwing the ball through the hole, uh, putting the ball in the hole, the, the sun, you know, taking shots at the sun and measurements with uh and then we know the magnets that they have and we know the magnetism it's all symbolic about the universe and you know we need to know more about the universe and less about this beast system and then we look at all of these uh referees involved i look through the list and i'm just trying to see some kind of pattern 
And I'm wondering why would they, you know, it's like, what stands out to me is the referees that this is their first finals and they just so happen to have four referees that have one final. This would be their first finals. It's four of them. Again, the 41-14 code, uh, LeBron James fourth title, the first title for Frank Vogel, the first title for his teammate Anthony Davis. So we see the 4-1 code embedded in the, the Laker team itself with Davis and uh, James. Uh, also, the owner of the Lakers, Jenny Buss. This will be her first title as the owner of the Lakers. We see the eyes on the prize again, and we see the schedule of the games. And what I'm looking at, uh, what I came up with so far, is uh, the Heat in Game 1, Lakers in Game 2, Lakers in Game 3, the Heat in Game 4, Lakers in Game 5, the Heat in Game 6, and then the Lakers in Game 7. The Heat take game games one and games four is symbolic of the loss of Kobe, the 41 uh, loss, the 4-1 going to the other team, and then the, the sixth game going to the Heat. The Heat owned the six with LeBron because he wore six with the Heat, so it's fitting that they would take game six. So I'm seeing them winning three games, and I think those are the three games they're going to win. Uh, now we have uh, Eric Spolster. This is his 334th day of age. And that goes with the uh, record of uh, Vogel getting his 34th loss. And staying on 43 wins in game one. It goes with Spolster getting his 84th win. And looking at Vogel, his record, 43 and 34, it's like you, you can see within his his uh, playoff record. And this is supposed to just playoff record right here where he'll get his 84th win. And it's going to segment into or segue into uh Vogel's record having something to do with that. We see this is his 101 day of age. We know that's the 26 prime number. Um, going to pull up his playoff record here. And we see that he has 43 wins and he has 33 losses. So when you look at his record with the 43, if he loses, then he will have 34 losses. So you have, so you have 433 going one way with that record win loss record and then you have 433 going the other way you see the mirror of 433 in his record and we know that 433 is the 84th prime number so that syncs up with Spolstra getting his 84th victory in game one um, this uh, is also symbolic of the series uh, going 4-3 which is a 14 prime number as I indicated earlier. And then we see the 433 is actually the 84th prime number. And uh, Spolster will get his 84th win. Uh, I see that the league is already doing a little psychological games and whatnot. It's like this game, it's like the Heat could win this game by 20 points, which will cause a psychological uh effect within people that will put their money on the heat because all the money at this point for the title was on the lakers uh, i found this article doing research and it says and then you see in this article you see 84 4, 4, 433 right there and that stood out to me because i was looking at that and then this article came up a 2000 acre woodley fire near ventura la county and this was actually in 2018 and uh, that just shows you that, the, you know, these fires occur in, in the West Coast in California every year. It's not anything new. They're going to always happen. Uh, and we see that uh, November, this article came out on November the 8th, uh, 2018. Lift the veil from your eyes. And it's kind of ironic how they use these terms and these phrases. 
this was in 2018 and now this is four years later and we're looking at the Heat and Lakers in the finals so I went ahead and measured from that date until now and it's 693 days and it's actually 22 months and 23 days and we see the NBA advertising LeBron 23 and Butler 22 where you see those two together and you know this is the first year that Butler has worn the number 22 normally he War 23, so, you know, it's a reason why they had them switch to that, that number. And I went ahead and wanted to pull up the uh, codes for championship and show you that the 125 is another championship code. I know a lot of people know about 131, but 125 is one as well, and we also see the 157. And the 125, it came up in the Super Bowl with the Chiefs and the Niners. And it's also embedded in this with the... Uh, Heat winning uh, with a score of 125 and Pope having number one and none wearing number 25. So, and as far as the game today, we're going to go with the Heat. Uh, if you have any questions or if you want to leave any comments and interact with the channel, it'd be great. Uh, I look forward to uh, hearing from you all. Have a good day.